Hello everyone, Dragon84 here and welcome back to Shotgun King where we are playing against increasing difficulties. Rank 12 is just difficult. So Makita again. Let's try this. Makita is definitely not my best gun but there are a lot of things that you can do that are very good with that. Um, as always, if you have um, any particular ideas about uh, me well, playing in certain ways in the future, uh, please let me know. Because, I mean... Uh, I, I am just struggling against the highest difficulty and maybe at some point that stops being fun for people. I can imagine that, so let me know if that happens because at that point it might be better to just take things down a notch for a second, reorient ourselves. I'm not at that point, but if my audience is, then I would love to know. Uh, oh, I want, don't want to checkmate myself. This wouldn't be checkmate, but it's better to go here and to not even be considered for that. Right? Yeah, we're, we're, oh, we're out of ammo. There are just so many enemies on this, uh, on this level. Oh, I did not expect you to go there. All right. So, oh yeah, got this, and I'm going to have to use my bishop's soul in order to survive, already. Yeah, this is so difficult, um, yeah, I'm gonna do this, and actually just this, this, this this I guess um, yeah I can't do anything about any of those uh, pawns so I'm just gonna do this and this and this and this well that one promoted and that one is going to so let's run away we have a queen a bishop and a king which should all be beatable without too much trouble. Uh, all right, where do we want to go? Maybe here? If I go here, nothing really bad can happen, but maybe I want to be on a white square. No. I want to try and make sure that there aren't any easy attacks against me because I'm very low on ammo. Ideally I'd want to be somewhere where the queen can check me and the bishop is going to land, land right next to me. That's not gonna happen. So let's go here I guess. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's good enough. Definitely good enough. Alright. Yeah, the queen is really annoying. Um, but the question is, do I want to use my rook soul to have a queen in reserve? Yeah, I kind of do. So let's do this. 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 This? Cool. Yeah, these <laughs> these early levels are so difficult. Hey, there's Bushido. Yeah, Bushido with Makita is just insane. We go down to two firepower, but then we have two blade, and the first blade we use every turn is free. <laughs> So we are very low on firepower now and crusades me means that there's a lot of bishops, uh, but a lot of knights. So we, we have some work to do there. 
Let's just do that. Um, move here because oh, I was kind of hoping for that knight to be, end up next to me. Maybe hoping isn't the great, the best strategy. But if I go here, I'm not going to be in check. So that's good. So we just kill this knight. Then we kill yeah this knight because it moves earlier. Then we kill this one for free. Then we shoot here. Don't have that. That was the perfect strategy, but oh yeah. That was a free turn as well. Yeah, Bushido is so insane on uh, Makita. Definitely the best thing you can do with this particular gun. Yeah, I'm gonna shoot just to have something to do here. Go here, that, blade, free, I'm in check, that's fine. Yeah, blade for free, blade for free, for free. All right, so and suddenly things got very easy. Uh, you have four HP. Yeah, come on. All right. <laughs> it's honestly kind of interesting how that just changes things. Um, plus three blade. Oh, but the undead armies are actually kind of not great for me here. No, I, I don't really need the plus three blade. It's just adding a queen. I don't know. Does remove the last bishop, which can be good for us in some situations. I'm gonna try the undercut mission. It can be very good. It can give us plus firepower, I think. It can do a lot of things. And we are pretty mobile right now. I mean, the knights don't say so, but we are mobile. Yep, extra turn. And now... If I move here, that knight can't put me in checks. Oh, wait, but then I am in check, so it's kind of a moot point. If I move here, I'm not going to be in check. That's good. Because then I can just massacre everything. Get an extra turn with every shot. There's the queen. I need to deal some damage to the rook. I want to get to the undercover spot. It's not in the best spot right now. Let's do this, this, get my extraction, then here, shoot at the queen. We did at least the one damage that we needed to. Yeah, we're not going to activate this, uh, the undercover mission this time, but that is fine. Bushido is so insanely strong. I mean, anything that gives uh, extra actions is good, but... Um, push it out. So, what, what what were the options again? I'm I'm mostly doing this so that I know for the next time what my options are. Um, more ammo is definitely not what I need right now. 
minus max HP to all white pieces. Th that can be very relevant uh, with the two queens, so that I can stab them in one uh, one hit. Um, now I'm just stabbing the white king and killing it. All right. There's Nightbane again. That would allow me to um, uh, to kill a rook in one swing, which is pretty important, and I'm not losing anything. I mean, there are a lot of knights there, and Taunting Hop makes me extremely mobile, which would help with the undercover mission. I don't know, there are so many knights. Oh wait, it's Taunting Hop. Oh, I'm using, I'm picking up Taunting Hop, that's insane. Yeah, and when, when you can do multiple things that give you extra actions, that's just going to win, usually. Don't do that. They're just blocking everything. Um, I need to move here so that I can kill the knight for free. Then... Probably try to move somewhere where I won't be in check, which should be here. Right? Yep. Then just massacre a bunch of pieces. I'm going to be in check from the queen. Not the best. Yep, there's the second queen. Well, at the very least, we can just kill basically anything for free. Uh, we do also have the taunting hop, which still leave, leaves me one damage short for the rook. So I'm not gonna use it right now. Yeah, I'm definitely not in the best position to actually... Oh. Oh, that's interesting. Um, yeah, so if I shoot now, then, um, and the queen moves here, if, if I miss, then things aren't great for me, then I have to use my queen soul. But if I move here, I can still do this and then this. And then this, I guess. I really don't need this. Yeah, I'm gonna do it anyway. Um, let's stab the White King. Just to have done it. Hmm, if I move here, the White King is going to move here. I'm going to do this. Yeah, that's not good enough. Um, next return. Yeah, the thing is... I don't need to kill those other pieces. I could do it for fun, but I don't have to. Fire range is pretty good. Max ammo doesn't really matter. Lookout tower might be a problem with the gender queer. Secret air isn't too much of a problem, I think. Cross blessing is pretty decent, honestly. Yeah. Um, it, it, it makes me a lot more likely to actually uh, kill pieces, uh, get pieces down to 4 HP or less, so this should be good. But I have to watch the secret air. Yeah, the, the current setup doesn't allow me a lot of opportunities to use Taunting Hop, but I don't have to use it a lot, just that... Um, Ooh, all of the knights are moving at the same time. Is that a problem? Might be. Um, the thing about Taunting Hop is that uh, as long as I can use it very effectively sometimes, that's still very good. 
Um, so can I move somewhere where I won't be in check? Sounds unlikely. Like, yeah, every every move I make, every step I take, they'll be checking me. I mean, what do you do then? Um, you can just shoot and... Yeah, that's probably for the best. Maybe I can shoot here and there's a chance for me to kill this knight. It's not a big chance. Alright. Yeah, this is still just insanely good. Second queen is on the board. Um, this one has 5 HP, so I can do this and then this. If I do this, I get an extra turn, but what am I hoping to accomplish then? Um, I can deactivate the secret air, probably. I don't even know if that works. I'd rather just do this. Um, all right. What do we want to do? Minus one max HP to all white pieces. Oh, that's insane. Let's do that. That's going to put the queen down to enough HP for me to actually do something with that. Oh, well, there's the secret air. Um, I can't stay here. I can't kill this pawn. So we move here. I'm in check, but that's fine. I hope. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, do this, do this, do this, do this, do this. I mean, I don't think there's a reason not to do this. Um, like this, like this, like this. Wow. A lot of misses there. My aim is so bad. But if I do this, then I jump over the king and kill him. <laughs> yeah, if the king has 5 HP, he's already out of luck. Um, the moat? The moat isn't my biggest problem here, there, there's a lot of knights on the board, Ravenous Rats, this is fine, Last Guardian can be very annoying, Military Academy could be a problem, I mean in general knights aren't my biggest problem but they can be extremely problematic sometimes. The thing is that <laughs> between Bushido and Taunting Hop I should be able to survive most things right now. Um, kind of just want Ravenous Rats and Military Academy, but maybe I need the moat. Maybe that uh, covers just the final point of weakness that uh, that I currently have, which is that at some point um, there could just be um, multiple rooks or queens coming down to my side of the board and just randomly destroying me that could be a problem but it also minimizes my ability to use souls which could also be a problem
right? The fact that the mode also restricts my access, but I am very mobile with the taunting hop. I'm gonna try this. It, it looks like uh, the mode minimizes one specific weakness that my position still has. Uh, while the other one, it, it makes one thing a little bit better that I already do. So I think this should be better for me. Yeah, these knights are just so annoying. Hey, hello secret air. I could do this. Is that good? Hop over here, kill this knight for free, then get out. Sure. Then first kill this pawn for free, I guess. Then kill this knight. And that one is uh, coming along. But it's not a problem, so let's just do this. Oh, he is annoying. Let's let him come to us. Oh, it's very busy there. I don't think I can realistically go there. No, let's let's just do this. Then do this. This. Oh, hello. Didn't actually think of that. Um, probably should have. This is going to be very annoying. Um, because I can't kill the queen right now. I have to move here. And then this queen is going to check me from like over here or maybe not. We'll see. Yeah, that's a thing. So I'm pretty sure that I'm safe over here, right? Nope. All right. Then let's not do that. By the way, there goes another opportunity to finish a run without ever using one of my shields, which is an achievement that I still need to get. Something to keep in mind. Oh wow, yeah, I forgot. I completely forgot that <laughs> I had still had this queen on full HP. That's it, now I need to use my queen soul, but at least I still live. I could use my queen soul to move over here. That's better, right? Yeah, if I move over here, that's mm -hmm. messy, so. That's fine. Do this. Do this. Um, yeah, this is the point where I do minus one max HP to all white pieces because <laughs> that one HP of that one queen is just a problem for me. I mean, I'm gonna shoot here even though it doesn't really do anything, but yeah. Uh, eh. Eh. Oh yeah, that's the thing. Oh, I really should have uh, thought about this. Now the the rook soul. Yeah, I could probably have had a queen soul here, but it's fine. It's completely fine. I hope. Blunderbuss. That's interesting. So I need a lot of firepower. And both of these um, make my fire arc higher. But plus 30 degrees to fire arc is a lot. But on the other end, I, I think I just need to do this. We're adding a bishop again, which is probably fine. Military Academy is a problem too. So yeah, I, I, I'm gonna do this and let's just hope that this giant fire arc isn't going to kill us. 
Or the lack of pawns, that might kill us too. It's really good. Right, let's see this. Kill a bishop for free, that's always good. Yeah, our fire arc is so large. Luckily, we can just kill a bunch of stuff for free. Uh, yeah, I mean, we just gotta do that. And this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and this. Oh, that was pretty good. Alright. So, our biggest problem now is that the queens have 5 HP. And we need to deal with that. Somehow. We have a very long range. I think I'm just going to try... That didn't work. Um, I'm going to move here. Jump over the queen, then get it for free. Then do this. Poison their water. I'm just gonna do that every time, I think. Oh yeah. Second queen. That's annoying. Oh, but... I do still have the rook soul that I need to get rid of, so... It's actually perfect. <laughs> yeah, I made a mistake by not um, not spending my rook soul earlier, probably, but it was definitely fine. Should probably have stood my ground and hopped over the king to deal with one damage, then killed it. But more firepower, yeah. Pawns, I, I don't care too much about pawns, and adding an extra queen would be a problem. I can't really use Royal Lopez very well, so. We're going at Pikeman. Pikeman is always very scary. There aren't even that many pawns. But we need to make sure that we aren't randomly putting ourselves in check now. Which can definitely happen. Uh, yeah, I'm going to shoot. This. This, this, uh, oh yeah, 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 with Pikeman, can't attack diagonally, so I can stand here freely, but after that, we might be in trouble. This pawn isn't more moving for a while, so this should be a, f a safe move. The knights aren't moving yet. I mean, it feels okay to do this. Let's try it. Then we have to move like here. To this, do this, do uh, yeah, I can't do this because I'm in check and I already used my Bushido extra action this turn. So we do this, these move at the same time, so we do this. Then this, that one is uh, on the move. Uh, this is a risk, so we're not doing that. Yeah, there's a lot of moves we can't make. Queen has too much HP, but we can move here. Jump over the queen, get our extra action. this, do this, do that, you're promoting. I definitely don't need that thing anymore, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Just to step to a white king for three. It does something, so it's fine. Of 
go. Alright, yeah, we are doing very well. Welcome gift is fine. Militia can be scary. Adding two pawns and removing a knight is honestly pretty good. Making pawns faster is kind of scary, especially when there's more pawns. But we don't need more ammo, and militia is scary too. I think. Oh yeah, militia pikeman. Pawns can move and attack in four directions. Yeah, that should be killer. So we're going to do this. Make our first shot count. I'm just always moving towards the question mark, even though I might not do that all that much most of the time. Uh, we can do this. Then use our welcome gift. Hello, you're welcome. It's kind of fine. Um, all right. I can move here, but does that really help us? That's the question, right? A lot of these pawns are covering each other. And this rook is moving in a second. The queen is moving in a second. So if I move here, then... Yeah, I don't think that's reasonable. Although, yeah, I really need a question mark. I'm gonna do it. This is going to give me an extra turn. So we're going to give minus one max HP to all white pieces. Which doesn't put the rook in fatal range yet. That's a problem, but I can do this. Then I'm, yeah, then this still counts as Bushido. I could actually jump over here. Yeah, that's good. This, then I'm not in check. And just make this into a massacre. Okay, there's the second queen. That's fine. And that's the second queen. Fine. If you can use taunting hub, you probably should, right? Oops. <laughs> Didn't even mean to do that. That's 4 HP. Eh. Eh. Cool. Yeah, this is not difficult. I mean, Sword of Justice is powerful, but... Um, hard to use and very easy to kill yourselves with um, and karma is just no even though I mean if we're on white squares then we can just use um, the the blade and that should be okay but on the other hand we have corner despot which we might not use all that much but when we use it it should be good and there, then there's cavalry which is going to be okay to deal with. I mean, none of this is great, but <laughs> yeah, we have to choose something, and this seems like the best out of those two options. All right, so uh, what are we shooting? This, and then this again. Sure. Um, here, kill a knight for free, can just do this, kill a bishop for free, go 
Got even more stuff for free. Got even more stuff for free. Yeah, th this was pretty good. Got more stuff for free? We have so much firepower. Um, I don't know if I'm in check right now because of the mode. I think I am. Let's assume that we are in check and then we just go here. Uh, we need to make sure that we can kill off the queens in one uh, hit. Mm. What do we do here? Probably move here. Yep. Oh, I don't want to kill this one, because if I do, then this pawn uh, becomes a new piece. Don't really want that. Oh, this queen is a problem. Right? Yeah, that's decent. Then make sure not to randomly lose the king. I still even have the queen soul. Let's stab the white king. What? Okay. Pretty good. Oh, a gutting maelstrom. I'm going to look at the saddle in a second. All right, um, this is our final pick, so we need to make very sure that it's the right one. You got a Maelstrom every 10 turns, plus one firepower. That's very powerful, especially since, I mean, we're, we're doing things pretty quickly, but that might end at any moment. Settle. Knight carry non-rook and non-knight pieces when moving. Interesting. And knights minus one speed. That's honestly pretty decent. I mean, ravenous rats. I don't know. It can be good. And conscription at one pawn every five turns. I don't know which one to pick here. I I lean towards the gothic maelstrom because it's very powerful. I don't have enough experience with saddle to know how good it is. But it shouldn't be too bad for us, especially since we actually want pieces to get close to us. So let's try this. I've seen Saddle at least once before, and I'm pretty sure I took it at least once, but we'll see. Yeah, the knights are a lot slower now. So this knight is going to take a piece with him, I guess. Yeah, he did. He took the king with him. Oh, you poor thing. Um, so do we reload or do we move? That's the question. I mean, I can pretty sure, I'm pretty sure I can just kill the king here. So let's go here, do this, and just kill the king. Well, that's unexpectedly <laughs> just won us. So settle can be a pretty big uh, problem for <laughs> your opponent too. All right, this is it, the big one. We're going to see how far we can go. Pretty sure a knight can't uh, take the big king. We found the secret heir, so that's something to keep in mind. Oh, I'm in check here, that's a problem. Um, but we can go here, be on the edge of the board. We can kill this one for free, so let's just do that. And now we have Corner Despot and Welcome Gift, 11 power. So we can just use that. That one has a lot of HP too. Um, King isn't even scary right now. I 
do feel like I still need to do this to do this extra turn over here because then we can just kill the queen. Here. Probably go here. Just start randomly killing stuff. Yeah, there's going to be a final bomb pretty quickly here. But yeah. <laughs> we are doing pretty well. I'm just gonna say we're doing pretty well. There's a lot of knights, yeah, this, this cavalry did add a lot of knights. So that's something. Uh, yeah, we're not adjacent to this big king, so that should be fine. Oh, fine. Yeah, we don't have a lot of ammo. Alright, pretty cool. We beat another floor. Uh, another rank. That's another achievement. Pretty good. Uh, I mean, yeah. Makita and Bushido, if you get those one together, you just win. That's really simple. So let's let's look at what the next one brings us. Rank 13, Rook plus 1 HP. Um, we're going to do that with Solomon. Another plus 1 HP to the Rook. Wow. Really interested to see how that uh, turns out in any case. This has been Dracon84. I hope you're enjoying yourself because we are still getting along and we're still winning randomly I mean that's not randomly that's it was random that we got a really good combination of cards but we did play well I think I hope in any case uh, I hope you enjoyed yourself and we'll see you on the next Shotgun King video goodbye